let's understand e-beam technology. Radiation has been used in various fields such as nuclear physics, medical and isotopes ever since X-ray was first discovered by the German engineer Wilhelm Konrad Röntgen. In 1952, radiation was used on polyethylene, an insulating material in cables. Electron beam system consists of an electron gun to generate and accelerate the electron beam. High voltage is used to produce a high energy electron beam. There is a magnetic scanner system to direct and control the electron beam when bombarding the material. The cross-linking process. Polymers are made of hydrocarbons having carbon-carbon as strong bonds and carbon-hydrogen as weak bonds. The electron beam irradiation is a process in which the polymer is exposed to the stream of electrons. The high-velocity electrons break the weak carbon-hydrogen bonds and create carbon-carbon double bonds which we call as cross-links between molecules. Cross-linking significantly improves the thermal, mechanical and chemical properties of the polymer. Five major effects of electron beam irradiation on cables. Increases temperature withstanding capacity from 70 degrees centigrade in normal wires to 105 degrees centigrade. Due to increased temperature withstanding capacities, the current carrying capacity increases to more than double. The cables are heat and melt resistant. Cables become abrasion resistant. Increases operating life from conventional 15 to 20 years to almost 50 years. In a simple demonstration, in a solder iron test, the copper in a normal wire gets exposed at the point of contact while in the electron beam wire the copper remains unexposed. The performance can be best demonstrated with this test where we connect an ordinary wire of one square mm in series with a PARS electron beam wire of one square mm. A normal wire carries 11 to 12 amperes of continuous current. Here we shall pass current of 40 to 41 amperes through them for the same amount of time. This is to see the performance of the wires in an overload situation. In just a few minutes, you can see smoke in the normal wires and in the next few seconds, the copper gets exposed. While there is smoke from the electron beam wire, the copper remains unexposed as this is heat and melt resistant. So, in case of an emergency, it is much safer. Small reason why cables and wires of Apar Industries are trusted and a leading name in electrical and telecommunication sector, used by the biggest industries across the world. For Apar Industries, it's a continuous mission of powering dreams globally by bringing you Tomorrow's progress today.